I'm running out of time, Elizabeth. The land is dying. People are suffering. Soon, we'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. And then... Extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia. The AIU designed to control the system. I'm walking under a brilliant night sky, through a field of flowers. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth, waiting for me, even though you've been dead for a thousand years. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. For a moment, I feel whole. But it never lasts. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So! What are we doing? Must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the Blight. Both, actually, but, um... I should... Oh, no. I've been dragging you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you. No matter what, you're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. Okay, but if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> A focus? Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device. 
we've got a lot to cover. Um, I'll have to explain everything as we go. You see like this all the time? Since I was a little girl. Come on. Shall we? All right, I got a couple of scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants, stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. These plants don't look like the ones in the sacred lands. The focus helps you see the ones we need. Ugh. Bitter? Yeah, well, at least they make you feel better. All right, we should keep going. Might want to grab more of these plants along the way. Yeah, good idea. just touched was slimy. I'll take your word for it. Those ruins. That's where we need to go. I see a few ways down. What are we after exactly? The backup? Well, um... It's an AI. It's, um... It's hard to explain. Think of it like... A set of instructions that can fix the world. left a carcass behind. A lot of arrows in that machine. Better take a closer look. Someone took down this machine recently. Who else would come here? I don't know. We better craft some arrows of our own. There might be trouble up ahead. There's some ridgewood by the stream. There's a All ladder. Right. Now to craft some but arrows. But I can't reach it from here. Nothing a well-placed arrow can't knock free. Just have to target the lock. Done. Me too. Arrows ready. That did it. After you.
The transmission... The, uh, message I found didn't say. Only that a backup might be here. We need to find a way in. The blight's not just poisoning plants. It's killing animals, too. Then people will get sick, too. And starve. We're not gonna let that happen. Down this way. Get to the grass. Never seen one of those before. Me neither. Those dead machines have it on alert. How do you want to handle it? The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. Give it a second. Okay. See how parts of it are glowing? Those are its weak spots. Got it. Another one's coming. reads data on the machine. Like a hunter studying its prey? Yeah, kind of. So after the fuss over me leaving, what did everyone else do? Well, as soon as the celebration was over, my mother led the rest of the Nora home. The Sun King put his people to work rebuilding the city. And I set out to find you. Another ladder. I need to shoot off the lock. Someone shot this machine, too. <laughs> yeah. Found my first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. It's good to have extras. Through here. Welcome to the Far Zenith launch facility. Far Zenith? I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but... Why would they have a backup of Gaia? 
I should be able to pry this open. They want us to check in with them. This climbing gear. Guess someone dropped in from above. Whoever left us here might have also shot those machines we found earlier. So where are they now? Ugh, what's that stench? The entire camp. Why doubt? They must have come here to delve for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. And it looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp. And then through the wall. I should take a look at the rubble in that gap. Find anything good? A few supplies. Oh. Oh, this stuff burns. Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. Aloy, over here. I think I got something. It's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. That could work. The focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Poor guy. Acid burned right through his armor. Machine cable. Stronger than rope. Part of a machine could help fix the gears. All right, I think I have what I need to repair the tool. Or maybe even make something better. You could use this workbench. There. Uh... Pole caster. Now to test it on the debris. than I thought. Well, it doesn't look like there's an easy way out of here. I should scan the area. We have to find a way to keep going. Well, that door huh. looks promising. What's this thing for? But how do I get up there? What's this? And it is my pleasure to introduce you to Far Zenith. Forget what you think you know about us. Our truth is simple. 
We say reach for the stars, even if you have to cross 8.6 light years of space to get there. Please, proceed into the auditorium, where we'll unveil our plans. Wonder what's in this auditorium. Guess we'll find out. Wow, that works. That pull caster's useful. Too bad there's only one. Don't worry, I'll find you another way up. Drop the ladder for Varl. Thanks. Humans, Homo sapiens, us. We have always pushed the boundary as explorers, pioneers, trailblazers. And now Far Zenith is taking the next leap into the future. That's why we're proud to have resurrected the Odyssey. When our government's abandoned in orbit, Far Zenith will actualize in less than a decade. But that's only the beginning. When the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. A serious system. There we'll create humanity's first off-world colony. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it, but when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Chimbumbe, the truest form of immortality is... Data corrupt. <laughs> Playback stopped. The old ones could fly through the sky? Between the stars? Uh... Well... Yes. Sort of. That ship, the Odyssey, it... It never made it to the other star. Something went wrong, and it blew up. Is that why Elizabeth gave them a backup of Gaia? For a colony? Error. Public presentation file corrupted. Member recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? Yeah, reactivate. Let's see what else they had to say. We all know the projections. Economic instability, new biocontagions, rampant AIs. How long before another catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite? We here at Far Zenith believe, escape the inevitable. And so we reach for the stars. Now you've seen what we're building here. Infrastructure to support the Odyssey's construction. A state-of-the-art data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements. 
And you've seen how we're managing public perception. So invest and join us. Claim your birth on the Odyssey. Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. Well, they were right about the world ending. I just didn't know how... yet. So everything they said back there about the next step for humanity... it was all a lie. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Yeah, well, didn't work out for them in the end. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. There. The backup. It should be stored in there. Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Come on. The wilds have really grown over this place. My focus might be able to help here. I should be able to pull that thing out of the wall. Show off. Those things to call in some friends from underground. Okay. You take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. Moving off. I need to sneak up on it to take it out with my spear. Can't let it see me. I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. There's its patrol path. Damn! Spotted! 
down too. More of those machines ahead. Nothing you and I can't handle.
I've been meaning to mention, I noticed you have a new look these days. <laughs> yeah, I know. Didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you. Don't worry, it's not permanent. Good. Sorry my whiskers offend you, anointed. Looks like this little guy got caught up in the blight. I couldn't escape. I hope it didn't suffer long. The Osram must have used explosives against the machines. We managed to get a couple. Looks like there was a barricade here. The machines must have broken through. I'll keep this for later. I guess that Osram didn't have a... Careful. Traps ahead. Oh. I might be able to disarm them. There. Managed to salvage some supplies. And not blow yourself Dismantled up. Dismantled it. And got more supplies. Looks like another camp. While we're here, maybe we can make some traps of our own. Might come in handy against machines. Good idea. Supplies to craft a trap, but it looks like the Osram shot off some machine parts. I might be able to scrounge up enough materials from them. I can use this. Okay, I should have what I need to craft a trap. There, explosive trap made. If anything walks into one of those, it won't know what hit it. They spotted us. I better scan them. I've seen this machine before. Scrounger. It's new to me. Let's see where its weak points are. Maybe we could place one.
here. Keep going, then. You've been in a lot of old world ruins. Are they all like this? Well, they all have their secrets, but every place is different. Big storm picking up out there. Yeah. And they're getting stronger. And more frequent. So the storms, the blighted lands, the rivers and lakes choked with algae. You were born to fix all that? Yeah. Mm. This data mentions the tech that Far Zenith traded with Zero Dawn. It doesn't explain how they got it back up. I'll keep an eye out for more data.
Looks like we've got to climb up. You okay? Yeah. Guess we won't be going that way. That looks like the way we came. thousand years old. Looks like some kind of meeting room. That door on the other side's... Onzu. The Zero Dawn terraforming system. The brainchild of Dr. Elizabeth Sobek. Empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering, an obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase 1. Establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn. Status complete. Phase 2. The asset will secretly beamcast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. If all goes well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades protocol. In addition, extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. I thought Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Far Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy, why does that woman look like you? Uh, um, it's okay, Paul. We look alike because... We're the exact same. Genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? Because I wasn't born. I was made. By a machine. It's why I'm motherless, why I was cast out as an infant. I don't understand. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup? is like a set of instructions. It's more than that. It's called Gaia. And for a long time, she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself. So she made me to bring her back. I'm the only one who can. And this place is my last hope. You once said the goddess spoke to you when you went into All Mother Mountain. Was that this Gaia? Yes, but she's not the goddess, Borl. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. <sighs> I've had a lot of time to figure this out. And you will too, with the focus. But for now, 
The report said they were going to store the stolen copy of Gaia in the data center. So that's where we have to go. Okay? Huh. Look at that. Aloy, over here. I found something you could use. A weapon. Thanks, Varl. We should keep moving. After you. Down here. I think we're almost back outside. Good. It's going in the same direction we're going. Stand a chance. So, you said this backup is the last hope. Yeah. All those places I've been these last few months, there were supposed to be more backups. But a thousand years ago, a guy named Ted Farrow purged them all. Was he part of Far Zenith too? No. He was worse. Looks like we can cross over here.
That big metal thing looks like the ship we saw back in the auditorium. Imagine going up to the stars in that. These guys couldn't catch a break. Machines patrolling ahead. We can tag them in the focus to keep track of them. There's a ladder in the back. So tell me something, Sona was really okay with you not going back to the sacred lands? As the Nora war chief, she understood why I was obligated to follow you. But as my mother, she wasn't pleased. Is she ever pleased? I don't think I've seen her smile. Me neither.
three of those things. And if they slaughtered all those Osirum, we'll never get through to the data center. There's no way to slip past them. They're too tough to fight head on. We could find a settlement. Convince some hunters to help us. That would take weeks, and we don't have that kind of time. Maybe all we need is that shuttle to fly. That thing? How? We'll figure it out. Just wait here. Aloy! Trust me. And there she goes. Just need to get over to the shuttle to figure out how to make it fall into the basin. Should be able to find a way across. Just need to get over to the shuttle to figure out how to make it fall into the big... 